one of those and one of those. Also got that on the back. Uh, it's uh, inside the Grippo Offshore Marathon E Class race boat. Okay, we'll have a look at that later. Okay. Nice looking tumblers. Some wine glasses, always useful. That's what it's supposed to look like once you've set it up. So let's have a look at what we've been sent. The first and most obvious thing is the bottle holder. And this can hold a wine bottle, or indeed a beer bottle, and it's got suction cups on the bottom. And they can stick to any, any smooth surface. So you can, if you want, for instance, you have to push it down, and you can stick it to your glass cooker top. It won't stick to worked surfaces like this. It, they're just not smooth enough. And it's actually quite difficult, you see I can lift the lid up, to move it once it's stuck down, which is good. What you have to do to release it is you have to lift these little edges up on each of the suckers and then eventually they start to work your way around. So that actually comes off quite nicely. If you haven't got a smooth surface to stick to, maybe you want that on, a, on the table, like this table, because this won't uh, only vaguely sticks to that, and you can use that to stick that to, and then and obviously you can then lift it up. You get some trays with it, and there's an upper tray, and that's useful for glasses, wine glasses. They've actually sent me some plastic wine glasses. I think most people use their own wine glasses there. But the idea of that now is that if I rattle the table about, that's not really going anywhere. And there's a bit of movement in there. So it gives it a bit of a bit of suspension, I suppose. There's a lower tray and I've got to be honest I couldn't really see the point of that these glasses don't really fit in there and a wine glass I suppose is too tall so I couldn't really see the point of that I suppose if you've got smaller glasses maybe sherry glasses or something maybe they'd fit in there or little tumblers and finally there's a, this one which we did use and that's quite handy just for two two wine glasses Put the two wine glasses in there and put the bottle in there yeah so that that works quite well well it's not the most romantic of meals is it really <laughs> but fish and chips on a friday with some carver well, i've got this carver and we're using the gripper mat um yeah, wine curler gri grippo says grippo yeah yeah uh the grippo and that stores your, your glasses up there. I think the idea obviously is if on, on a boat uh, you can pour, pour the wine in there and doesn't move about. I was also if you were taking it outside or something. Yeah if you're taking it, it outside because it's got a yeah. it's got these suction feet and it can't move so I suppose. Ideal on a windy day probably. It's a windy day today isn't it yeah. that's why we're eating inside the van. Looks, I haven't got any ice unfortunately but this is nicely chilled. Yeah, the fridge has done really well today, isn't it? Yeah. Been out in it. That's going to go. Not too bad, is it? Yeah. So we're sort of celebrating um, being on a campsite, really. <laughs> <laughs> Cheers. Mm. Cheers. Cheers, everyone. Oh, great thing about that is if you move the table. Yeah. If you knock it. Yeah. Plus you've got the wine cooler. Mm. Because sometimes I'm sort of reaching for 
you know, if the table moves, mm. Poppy mm. knocks the table, he's up mm. grabbing things. Mm. They could be all over the place, but. Yeah, because I mean, with a wine glass like that, it's probably quite easy to mm. knock over. Yeah. Plus, if we ever get that yacht. Yeah, we'd be, it'd be ideal, wouldn't it? Yeah. So I suppose the burning question is, would I buy this from a motorhome? The answer is no. No, it's. Uh, I think it's a bit bulky, and I'm not really sure I'd get them that much use out of it. And it, it's not a storage solution as such. I mean, it's a great sol uh, solution if you've got lots of people coming around for drinks, and if I had perhaps a power boat or a, a hot tub. I think the sucker thing is quite handy. That's quite a nice drinks tray so I suppose if you're fond of entertaining lots of people with your motorhome yeah maybe what do you think let me know in the comments below is it something you'd buy um, maybe you do more entertaining than I do be interested to see what you say so if you like the video give us a thumbs up remember to subscribe and we'll catch up with you in the next one and that will hold obviously one bottle or any other bottle I'll start that again. It comes with this plastic tray. Now, presumably, that's got like little feet on it, little rubber feet on it. So you can use that and the bottle holder.